Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. I'm James and today I'm doing the main flight of our Aeromite RC plane. This is the Aeromite that I've built off a set of plans. As I say in all the introductions to my videos of this build series, this is not an ARF. This is not a plane you can get from a kit, a box kit. You have to build it off a set of plans. And if you go to the introduction video of my build series, I mentioned a few ways on how to get that. So it's been a long time to get to this point. I've had over 20 videos. It's been many, many weeks. But we're finally ready to do the maiden flight. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so the Aeromite has a 35-inch wingspan. Up in the front there, I have my OS 15LA. That's a 0.15 cubic inch two-stroke glow engine by OS Engines. It's a wonderful engine. And then the fuel I'm using, I'm just using VP racing fuel with 15% nitromethane and 18% oil. I'm going to go ahead and start by getting it fueled up, then we'll get the engine warmed up, and then we'll take it out and taxi it around and see how it behaves on the ground. I want to check the landing gear, see how it tracks. Hopefully it'll track okay. I may have to tweak the landing gear a little bit, but then after that we'll go ahead and take it up. We only got a two ounce tank. Should give me about a five minute flight. Okay, we now we'll check our voltage before we go. We got four cells in here and I'm at 99%, so that's good. It's not gonna take a lot of power to run these servos. Now we'll just do a check of everything. There's our elevator, rudder, ailerons. tracking to the right so I'm going to have to adjust that That seems to be a lot better. That seems to be a lot better. I was tracking to the right too much. Landing gears a little tweaks. Let me see here. Let me push that left landing gear down a little bit, I think.
So as you saw, I had to adjust my landing gear a bit. I had to tweak the tail gear a little bit. I tweaked the main landing gear a little bit. It seems like it's tracking okay for its flight. So we'll go ahead and give it a go. We'll go ahead and refuel it and we'll take it up. No more procrastination. It's time to go. That's about all we need right there. That's good. that yellow stripe on the right wing so I can keep myself oriented. Let's bring it in close. We'll take a look. I'm only flying right now at about half throttle. I have to say this thing is flying much better than I thought it was going to fly. Being a small plane like this, they get pretty squirrely. This thing is very, very smooth. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and set up for landing because I know I've been flying for a few minutes here. And I don't want to do a dead stick. Here we go for landing. Landing! Oh, I got a lot of, got a lot of room with this guy. landing but that's all right let me go grab it okay folks well that was the maiden flight and man i'm really happy about how that came out i was a nervous wreck but yeah it flew very very nice i had to put a little bit of a trim to get it to roll back to the to the right a little bit but overall it flew really really nice i did come down as you saw and i hit my landing gear here and i and i stalled the engine i hit the prop but overall it flew really nice i'll take a look and see how much fuel i used but yeah that was a successful uh, maiden super happy and yeah, awesome plane. So it looks like I used about half of my tank, maybe a little less than half of my tank on that flight. And it was only a few minutes, so I'll have to check and see how long it was. But yeah, that's plenty of fuel. So let me go ahead and get this fueled up again and we'll go up again.
Landon. Boy, it really, really falls out of the sky like a hitch. All right, that's good. Watch out for our prop. Okay, well there you have it. I did four flights and four landings and my landings are getting better than the first one. It glides in nicely. I kind of have to get used to that, but it does have sort of a steep glide, kind of a glide path, but overall it comes in nice. And boy, it flew very, very nice. And boy, I'm looking forward to more, many more flights with this plane. So again, you know, thank you very much for tagging along with me in this build. It's been a long time and sheesh, I'm glad this is over because I was nervous as heck to get this up in the air. And I'm so happy I can take it home in one piece. And yeah, so like always, thank you for watching my channel. I always appreciate it. And we'll see you next time.